HGL and 105 regulations state that wherever possible, a dental surgery should have a separate sterilisation room. However, due to space constraints, this is not always possible. The guidelines go on to say that when reprocessing instruments within the clinical area, this should be carried out as far away as practically allows from the dental chair. The decom pod is a prefabricated sterilisation room which houses all your requirements within the space of 1.2 metres square. The decom pod is fabricated from a solid surface material making it bacteria static. It is a sleek clinical design that wouldn't look out of place in any surgery. On opening the doors, you will see that it houses the regulatory two sinks, one for instrument washing and the other for rinsing. There is the handpiece oiler and steriliser and at the base you have the instrument washer. Once the instruments have come out of the washer, there is a pull-out drawer which enables you to set down your instruments and an examination light which enables you to check that the instruments are free from any debris. Once the instruments have been cleaned and inspected, there is a pull-down section here and a pass-through which houses an ultraviolet light to stop any bacteria build up whilst we close the pod. Once the doors are closed by pressing a button on the side, the pod rotates 180 degrees to its second resting position. This takes approximately seven regulatory sink for hand washing and once your hands have been washed you can retrieve your instruments from the pass through area. Now as you know there are some autoclaves that require instruments to be bagged prior to sterilisation and there is an area here at the bottom to house bags of various sizes. So one would either bag your instruments at this stage and put them in the autoclave or autoclave them and then bag them. There is also a set down area here. The decom pod houses air filters for the extraction of steam which builds up during the sterilisation process and it also dispenses reverse osmosis water. If you would like to see the pod, you can come and see it for yourselves at the NEC Birmingham Showcase in October and we would be happy to answer any questions that you may have.